A Virginia Beach teen accused of bringing a gun to a high school yesterday now set to appear in court today. Virginia Beach police arrested 18 year old Cavante Hawkins on multiple charges and now safety is at the top of mind as school administrators try and find a solution. Ann Sparacco joins us live now in Virginia Beach with the latest and walk us through this story. Well, Bethany, in just less than two hours, Cavante Hawkins is expected to face a judge for allegedly bringing a loaded gun to Bayside High School yesterday morning. Now, this is just the latest in a series of incidents in which police say students have made threats online or they have brought uh, weapons onto school property just in the past month. And now leaders of the uh, city of the Virginia Beach Education Association say they want to address this problem head on. It's a concern on top of mind recently. How do we address school safety? Wednesday morning, Virginia Beach City Public School administrators said they found a loaded handgun in a Bayside High School student's book bag after someone reported a concerning social media post. Officers arrested 18-year-old Cavante Hawkins for having a stolen gun out of Chesapeake and bringing it to school. This comes weeks after police said a student brought a gun to the Renaissance Academy in Virginia Beach and three Ocean Lakes high schoolers got arrested for making threats online. There are lots of moving parts in it. I think as we look at our community, students need to feel and all people need to feel heard and seen. Kathleen Slindy leads the Virginia Beach Education Association. She says one answer is not going to solve this entire problem. Uh, we don't have enough school nurses. We don't have enough. Um, we certainly don't have enough counselors. And then we have um, we the schools have done um, extra things by bringing in behavior specialists, but there aren't enough of those. There just there just aren't enough adults with relationships with kids. A spokeswoman for the school division confirmed Bayside High School does not have metal detectors. Slindy says better security measures are needed as they work to address the mental health aspect. We need to have something to keep them out of our keep weapons out of our school. We need to have students and families and uh, school personnel watching, listening and reporting. And Slindy says she hopes to have a roundtable discussion soon, including parents, teachers, students, even school resource officers to best create a better approach to help students at the end of the day. Reporting live in Virginia Beach, I'm Ann Sparaka for 13 News Now. And thank you. Now Hawkins faces multiple charges, including having a stolen handgun and bringing that gun onto school property. It's still unclear exactly how Hawkins got a hold of the gun.